So today I'm going to be sharing my first empties video and I'm really excited because I have been saving this box full of things and just throwing things into here as I finish it and my mom has been really confused of why I have a box of empty things because she's a clean freak and she's just like I cannot comprehend but yeah I've been saving it for you guys well to share with you guys because yeah I don't know I thought it would be interesting I don't know let me guys or let me know down below if you guys enjoy these types of videos or want to see more because I will keep filling up this box and my mom will keep wondering why I'm so weird but she's I think she's already accepted that I'll never be normal so I'm just gonna reach from my box and yeah so let's start the first thing is this pst instant dry shampoo and I've purchased this probably five times it's just really good to absorb the excess oil in your hair or when your hair is looking like like limp noodles then it will just help kind of just boost your hair absorb the oil and stuff um yeah I like it it doesn't last too long on me but I find that if you need like something really quick this is the way to go next product I've also repurchased lots and lots and lots of times it's my John Frieda luxurious volume conditioner and the only thing I don't like about this is that I go through it really quickly. It may be because um, my mom and my brother also use this conditioner just because it makes their hair feel really soft. Just like, yeah, that's why I use it because it makes my hair soft. Next thing is St. Ives Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Scrub. I really like this scrub. I like it more than the apricot scrub because this one's less harsh and it also smells good. And I love anything green tea, green tea or thing. And yeah, I really like it. Um, repurchase this also multiple times. Next thing is also a staple in my life. It's the Crest 3D White Luxe Glamorous White Toothpaste. I like it a lot because, um, well, it helps keep my teeth not to be so yellow and I drink a lot of tea and coffee on a daily basis so this just really helps. I also have a Dr. Jar Acne X Body Treatment Mist and I've been using this on, well, I've used it for my back acne which is gross but it's true because it happens and this is just really easy because it has a spray bottle and you just go like this and like spray your back or wherever else you have um, body acne and it was really expensive I bought this in California from somewhere I forget where I was but um, I got it from a shop and it was expensive so I probably won't repurchase not to mention I don't even wear it I don't even know where I could buy this because I didn't even find it on eBay so yeah next thing is an Etude House aloe moist full soothing cream and I've used it up as you can see I can't bring myself to throw it away because it's so damn cute and I was thinking that I could just use it for something else I didn't particularly like this product because I didn't find it to be super moisturizing but it smelled really good and yeah it was also nice while it lasted but I will not repurchase uh, more Etude House things I have um, an Etude House Oh My Eye line which is a brown liquid liner I really like this eyeliner because it doesn't smudge, it doesn't budge, it comes off super easily so I use it a lot especially when I'm filming and I don't feel like you know spending a long time removing my makeup afterwards because all I'm gonna do after is watch anime in my room so yeah I really like this, this is my second one and I will most likely repurchase after I finish up my current liquid liner so yeah and another Etude House item here, we have the Etude House Surprise Essence Concealer in number 2. This is one of my absolute favorite concealers, and I've repurchased this many, many, many times. And I found a new HD concealer, so I don't know if I'm going to be repurchasing this anytime soon, but you never know, I might go back to this. It's a very oldie but a goodie favorite of mine. I also have another concealer, it's the NYX HD Concealer, the photogenic one, and it has no pa- Talc, talc, and it's paraben free, and it's in the color CW006, and it's called Glow. This is a really also, it's also a really good concealer. Oh, I'm sorry, I cannot talk today, but I really like this as well. It covers under eyes really well, but now that my skin is really dry, I don't find that it's particularly flattering on my dry skin. It kind of accentuates it, and it doesn't look good. So when I had oilier skin. This was like, this was like, this was the ish. <laughs> Next product is the Misha 4D Mascara. I've mentioned this so many times and I've also used it in numerous tutorials and things. This is one of my absolute favorite mascaras. It's just a hassle-free mascara. I know that it works well. It makes my lashes very natural looking, separated. It doesn't flake, it doesn't smudge. It's also only five bucks. Uh, I usually buy it on eBay. Next thing in my box is this Roto V Eye Drops. If you guys work uh, in front of a screen all day or you watch a lot of TV or your eyes just feel really tired a lot, these are amazing or this is amazing. It's the Roto-V Cool Eye Drops. 
I use these all the time because I work in the technology field and I stare at a computer all day and my eyes feel really tired and also can get a little red. So this is amazing. It's really scary at first. It's really minty feeling. For the first 30 seconds, you're like, oh my god, what is life? But afterwards, it just feels so cooling and refreshing. Next product is the Aria Star Argan Oil and I've used up an entire bottle. I love different types of facial oils and things. Um, I use this for my hair for the most part and I just apply two drops and apply it basically to my roots. I concentrate it onto my roots and it just works really well. It makes my hair really frizz free and look very healthy and natural in like its natural state. It still looks good. I got that from Amazon by the way for about $12.99. Last empties is the Nivea Extend and Moisture 48 Hours Lotion and I wasn't particularly fond of this lotion because it took a while to absorb into the skin and it felt greasy so excuse me I will not be repurchasing this so that is it for my empties I hope you guys found this video interesting if you like these types of videos definitely leave a comment down below just let me know you liked it and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and thank you guys so much for watching I will leave my social links down in, in the info box so feel free to creep on me so I can creep on you and yeah definitely feel free to talk to me because I love talking to you guys so that is all I'm gonna stop throwing my hands around okay bye guys